Oh, I don't know about you, but I'm having a great time tonight. This is some fantastic act. What do you think? What right about now? I'm thinking about what did I get myself into? Oh, you'll be fine, but Mr. Devine. But I will need some help because this is kind of a long song and it's just me and the guitar, so you might get a little bored. So I want you to sing with me if you want to, and especially the chorus. It's pretty simple. We do it a lot, and you'll pick it up. Long, long time ago, I can still remember when the music used to make me smile. And I knew if I had my chance that I could make those people dance and make me, make me happy for a while. My most memorable moment with Mr. Devine was either my 7th or 8th grade year during track. The high schoolers came over and um, we were running and he complimented on how good my form was and that just really stuck with me and just having him as a coach uh, for my freshman year track meant a lot and he really helped me just when I was going through hard times or had a bad day, he just would cheer me up. The thing I remember the most about uh, Mr. Devine is the seasons that we spent coaching cross country and track together. Um, his attitude, his sense of humor, uh, spent a lot of time getting to run with him during practice and the conversations that we had about uh, teaching and coaching I'll never forget and um, have made me a better teacher and a coach. My most memorable moment with uh, Mr. Devine was joined the track team and we're just sitting there and he's, I've never done it before and we're sitting there and he's like, all right, we're going to show you how to throw and he's doing spins and he falls down. Everybody laughs and he goes, look Schaefer, if I can fall down, you can too. And then great friendship from there on out. I guess there are so many memories um, of Mr. Devine. Uh, I've known him since I was 14 and everything from swimming to working together to he was my mentor when I was coaching swimming. I had his daughters uh, as members of my swim team when I was coaching at the middle school years and years ago. Um, just too many memories to, to think of. And we just hope, I hope that uh, the family's doing okay. And I know he will be greatly missed. My most memorable moment of Mr. Devine um, was during track when I always had a doubt about one of my events I could always go to him. And He'd always cheer me up and get me ready for my race. I'm going to remember Mr. Devine the most by all the things he's done for the swim program. Because he first started up the Delta Flyers that later became DAC, and that's the program I swam for for so many years. And if he hadn't started that, I never would have started swimming. That's probably what I'll remember the most about him. You know, Kevin, you asked me about giving a most memorable moment that Mr. Devine and I spent together that I remember about Tom and you know to really give you just one would kind of diminish a little bit our professional relationship he was a colleague of mine he was a friend every day was a was a memory Kevin um, I can't tell you enough about about Mr. Devine and, and the relationship that we shared here for 30 plus years in the in the gymnasium uh, uh, we talked about a lot of things, our families, sad times, glad times. Um, the, the big thing that sticks in my mind, Kevin, is that when we found out the severity of, of, of Mr. Devine's illness, and, and then again this year when we knew he wasn't coming back to, to, to Delta, people would ask me, um, have you seen Mr. Devine lately? How's he doing? And, and while I didn't really say it to him, I thought to my mind, in, my, in the back of my mind, I knew that I see Mr. Devine every day. Uh, every day that he's been gone, I'm going to see him every day um, in the future, uh, in the balcony, in the pool, sitting in his office, talking. Uh, he's just been a real strong fixture here at Delta High School for, for all of us, and uh, he's going to be missed greatly.